what's up guys? <laughs> Did you just clap like me? Can you, can you say, what's up guys? Say, what's up guys? You're just gonna stick your tongue out? All right, so we wanted to do uh, something new in this episode of the vlog. And a lot of you probably remember when Pablo was behind the camera and we were doing the kicks of the day videos every single day until I told him that I could not buy a new pair of shoes every day. It's not sustainable long term. But I've getting get so many questions about shoes and why I love shoes. And so I just wanted to bring you here into my place. You like that one? Yeah. Okay. And we're gonna talk about some of our favorites, kind of go through a few of those. She's gonna pick out some of her favorites. You wanna tell everybody your name? What's your name? Elsa. Elsa, what's your real name? What's your real name? Arden. Arden what? Arden, Arden McKenzie Harris. Arden McKenzie Harris? Uh -huh. What's your name? Tyler, Jack Harris. Hey, do you want to do a dance for us before we start? That'll get us going. Let's see a dance. Perfect, okay. All right, so what I want you to do is I want you to pick out your favorite shoe of all of these. This. That one? Yep. Do you know what this is? This is a Nike Fear of God collaboration. These are some of my favorites too, buddy. Yeah. Do you like those? Do they kind of look like space boots? Uh -huh. Like an astronaut would wear? Uh -huh. Okay, well I'm gonna tell you my favorite, which is this one right here. Do you know what this one's called? Yeah. Cactus Jack. Jordan 1s. Can you say Cactus Jack? Cactus Jack. Do you like these? Do you like the pink laces? Are those manly? Maybe I like the other ones the match. Oh, well, which ones do you like? These? Yep. Do you have these same shoes? Yeah. Do we, do we wear them together all the time? Yeah. And we're twins? Yeah. Yep. Mmm, I like that. Way up on the list these days. These just came out. These are by far in the top five, I would say. Which ones? Those? Why those? What do you like about them? Because you like the orange laces? Those are called Prestos. Can you say Presto? Those are called Fear of God as well. Yeah. Those are the same ones, just different colors. So as you can see with the Yeezys, we've got a lot of the 350s and a lot of different colors. A bunch of those. These are kind of the original. Yeah. Those? What kind of print do those have on it? Is that leopard print? Yeah. Yeah. You know which ones? These are in my top five too. Uh -huh. These are called the Nike Air Max One Paras. These were extremely hard to get a hold of. It took me like six or seven months. And of course I'm showing the side with a giant scrape. Which brings me to an important point. I actually wear all these shoes. A lot of people buy shoes, they keep them in the box, they don't wear them, but I wear all of these shoes. So these, I can literally remember I was in the first grade and I had these shoes and I wore them every single day. So when these re-released, I had to get them. I've only worn them once. Do what? Those are astronaut shoes. Yeah, they look like it, don't they? Let's see. I don't want to be an astronaut. You want to be an astronaut? I said I need an astronaut costume. An astronaut costume? Yeah. We do need to get one of those. Yeah, I do. So we got all the Jordans on this whole shelf. Oh, I like the purple ones. The purple ones? Yeah. Yeah, me too. Take them what back. about what about these? Oh, what kind okay. of what kind of animal prints are on these? What's that? The sleeper. And what's that? Um, a um, what? I don't know, maybe a cheetah? That what? looks like a cheetah. And that looks like a lion. It was a Feel tiger. It. Feel it. Yeah, it is a tiger, you're right. You are right, you are smart. You're right, that's a cheetah. Yeah. What else we got? These, I got in New York City. They just released them in one Why particular I store. I don't know if I've ever worn these. Not big on white, on sneakers. These I wear all the time, the Wave Runners. They have been absolutely worn out. They're ah, dirty. Look. Dirty, dirty, these are them. Different color, different color. 
You got a blow pop? Does your tongue match your dress? <laughs> these are probably the most hideous shoes that I own. These Yeezys, I can't even remember which ones these are called, but they are insanely comfortable, but man, they are ugly and dirty. Do you want to play? Does he want to play with you after the camera? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what about what about these? What kind of what kind, what kind of pattern is that? Does that look like a snake? Like a snake skin? But, um, do you, I want to show you my bench. Well, we can do that here in a minute. These are another one of my favorites. Took me a while to find the acronyms. Oh, those are like my baby. They are. Yeah. Me too, buddy. Really, really like these. Just very, oh, very no, different. No, no, those are not my and then we got the off whites. No, those are not my off whites, no, off whites. Those are not my these are, or these are my favorite. Those your favorite switches so often. How do you know? I can't hold these. You can't hold those. That one looks really big for some reason. That looks like I get my the bag too. Oh good. Thank you, buddy. Do you like shoes too, just like Daddy? How many different pairs of Yeezys do you have? No, 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 no. I would like <laughs> to match those shoes. You do like to match those shoes. <laughs> yeah. You got the best shoes in the kindergarten game. I have never for my Alpha <laughs> I need for my Alpha What else? These are definitely good ones, the Rookie of the Years. Good color combo there. Would you like these at all? Yeah, not so much. No. No, you don't like these. No, That's okay. Like That's you okay. Do you want to let me in my bedroom? Uh, yeah, for sure. Not right this second. So these are just like my favorites. That's why they're displayed out here in the living room. It's kind of weird. Those are. These two. You got good taste, buddy. There's probably 50 or 60 more pair in the room, but these are probably the most unique, the most rare, most valuable, the ones that I wear most often. All right, so if I had to go with some favorites on some categories, I would say of all the off-whites, so we got the off-white Prestos, the off-white Vapor Max, we got these new ones. It would be a close tie between these two. These are just so different. Like and these were the first off whites ever got. And it took me forever to find like them. You like these? Yeah. Yeah. So Greenville, South Carolina actually has an incredible amount of uh, sneaker suppliers, if you will. I just want to wear this for work later. Maybe. Maybe. So there's Varsity Goods, Soul Supply, and uh, Hyped Experience are probably the three that I primarily buy from. And you know, literally I'll just scroll through, look at their Instagram stories. If I see something, I'll just DM them and be like, hey, hold those for me. And uh, sweep by whenever I can. Usually I'm traveling, I'm like, hey, I'll be back on Thursday. And uh, come by and sweep by and pick them up. But there's something for me, I think about shoes. I think back to like being a kid and there was something like special about getting a new pair of shoes. Like it just felt amazing, felt just, I don't know, super cool, I think. And so as I got older and became more successful, I just wanted to feel that all the time. <laughs> and so I think that's where it stems from. Um, but you know, my style very much, I'm not wearing sneakers today, but I'm literally in like a t-shirt, jeans and sneakers pretty much all the time. Not a lot of suits being worn uh, around here. Somebody I had on my podcast talked to me the other day about uh, the tuxedo, which is like the comfy look is like, the new entrepreneur style is the tuxedo, which is basically like Lululemon, like sweatpants, Nike, just like anything to be comfy, hoodies, things like that. But um, I'm gonna become the Steve Jobs of, of t-shirts. I would say the shoe out of all of these that gets worn the most is probably, it's probably a tie between these Easy 350s, I think these are called like the Yakil or something. It's crazy. Every one of the shoes have the most ridiculous name. Um, the Wave Runners, these have been absolutely worn slap out. And then probably the Cactus Jack. 
Jordan 1. You can see the swoosh is backwards on it. Just super, uh, super unique. So when it comes to actually like working out, so these are the shoes that I run in. The Hoka's, got a bunch of these, try to rotate them. Um, had to go a full size up, toes kept getting crushed. Um, and then when it comes to just like working out, these are typically my go-to, the Nike Reacts. I've got about four different color, color combos in those. So those are the ones that get used and abused. So I would say out of this entire collection, these are the oldest. I mean, these are probably, I got these five years ago or so. Um, so the oldest as far as me purchasing them. However, I believe these, the guy I bought them from literally kept them brand new, never worn in the box for like, I don't know, 15 years, however long. So those are definitely a good one. The most recent purchase is these though. I mean, these, these Jordan 5 Off-Whites. This is, this is like so much going on here. You got like the see-through, you got the tag, of course, on the off-whites. You got the lace holder there. And these are about as, about as sick as it gets when it comes to a shoe. Um, but yeah, and the other thing I have because of all these is I have a bag with probably a hundred different color laces in them. Um, every now and then I'll switch the laces out, but usually most, especially the off-whites, come with like two or three different sets of laces. And, Sometimes you can mix it up that way. Say thanks for stopping by. Thank you so much for time. But it's time for us to play. It's a most to belly. Yeah. <laughs> to belly? To play. Oh, to play. Hey, do you want to sing Let It Go real quick? Let it go, let it go. That's it? Perfect, there perfect, we go. fine. You got to dance too. <laughs> the dramatic finish all right guys so there you have it just a random video this week going through some of the shoes in the shoe collection glad this one got to join me along the way who is now i promise you're going to take every shoe from the shelf and probably put it on the couch and then i'll have to put them back on the shelf is that what you're doing uh -huh. is this a game yeah okay is this a fun game for you Okay. Thank you for watching this episode of the My Living Legacy vlog. If you haven't done so already, make sure you go to the YouTube channel, hit subscribe, and we'll have much more entertaining content from this one coming out soon.